时候。You'll only eat vegetables today. Eat. <laughs> Jen Jen, tell me the truth. You bit someone else? <laughs> Ling Xiao? What is this? Hey. Why didn't you go and wake me up? I could have cooked for you. Ma, it's okay. I like instant noodles. Ah, uh, hello. Ah, uh, uh, come in. <laughs> We're just passing by. We brought you some fruit. Uh, thank you, you're so kind. Please, come in. Oh, all right, so... It's fine. Keep your shoes on. I haven't cleaned oh, yet. Okay. Please, come in. Chen Ting. Yeah? Are you not feeling well? Oh, I'm okay. You see, I just... just woke up from a nap. Uh, sorry, I didn't know you were coming. I don't have anything prepared. I brought Mrs. Chen for a visit. You won't be staying, dear. <laughs> Please, sit How down. come Ling Xiao is eating at this time? Uh, he just wanted a snack. <laughs> he did have lunch. And he really likes instant noodles. Say hi to them. Hello, grannies. How are you? Uh, how sweet. Aww. Hello, We're dear. good. <laughs> Want some tea? Of course, dear. Anything will do. Mm. He's such a nice kid. <laughs> Don't let him make tea. He might get burned. It's fine. He can do it. Chen Ting, you've been here for about a month now, right? Why do you always keep yourself locked in here on your own? Well, I think it's too hot outside. I don't want to go out. <laughs> You're becoming a recluse. Even Ling Xiao barely goes out. Look at him. He's playing all by himself. See, people like us, often, we're at Hai Chao's noodles. We eat good food, and we talk to each other. We play mahjong. It's a lot of fun. Yes, it is. But I don't play mahjong. 
It doesn't matter. You'll learn how to play. To be honest, Mahjong is more about socializing than anything. Look at you, keeping yourself indoors all the time. The only other person you see is Haping, right? That's why you keep fighting. Oh, look. Thank you, my dear. Oh. Goodness. Uh -huh. Ling Xiao, how kind. Ling Xiao, eat your noodles now. Ma, I've had enough. I want to play. Uh, go ahead. Oh, that boy is really something. <laughs> yes. So thoughtful. <laughs> you came for a reason. Is it because Hopping and I had a fight? No, 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 no. no, no, no. no. <laughs> Families will always quarrel. But yesterday, we were having dinner at High Chow's, and suddenly, in came Hopping, so we talked about you. Oh, what did Hopping say? Oh, he said good things. Yeah, he did. <laughs> really? I'm telling you the truth. I'll be frank. I understand your situation. When I was younger, about your age, I used to be the town school teacher. In three years, I gave birth to two kids. I wanted to be a good mother. I had no choice but to quit my job. And then I stayed at home, took care of the kids and managed the household. See, my husband, he's a doctor. He's not much help with housework at all. He's a busy man. He would work all day and all through the night. Oh, but I was tired too. Every time I saw him, I couldn't help but get upset. He doesn't understand. Mm. Right. Just like with Hupping. Every time I need help, he's out helping others. But that's what his job entails, dear. It doesn't matter. He should have time for a family. Oh, well, that's right. I'm not very good with words, but that's what I meant. It's his job to help his wife. <laughs> but my dear, after all is said and done, men work hard so they can support their families. He's the breadwinner. You're the homemaker. We play our parts. Hubbing has a strong sense of responsibility. When you take care of the kids, he can focus on providing for you. You're drinking? You celebrating? Why don't I join you? <laughs> Straight alcohol? No food? <laughs> All right. I'll make you some food, okay? <laughs> Can you play outside? Uh, hey. It's late at night. Why do you want him outside? Get out. Hey! What is going on here? Listen, I've had a long day. Please don't give me a hard time. So it's my fault? Mrs. Fang and Mrs. Chen, they came today to lecture me. What's that about? Why would they do that? Hey, Li Xiao! What did they say? You don't know? Huh? They knew so much. How would they know if you didn't tell them? I don't tell anyone things about our family. I swear to you, I never told those women to come bother you. <laughs> Fine, let's forget about it, huh? I'll go change clothes, okay? I have to work overtime tonight, okay? Don't you dare leave the house, Hopping. Oh, hey, Chen Ting. My co-worker's kid is sick. I told him I'd cover his shift, okay? Your co-worker's kid got sick. You help out. Where were you when your own son was sick? Chen Ting, huh? Chen Ting. Don't drag our son into this conversation, huh? You're done. <gasps> no, I'm not! Enough! <sighs> Can you lay off me? I'm begging you to lay off me. I beg you. I'm so tired. I'm exhausted. Fine. Thank you. I let you. Hey! Chen Ping! What are you doing? Don't touch me! I'm leaving you. I'm going to 
killing my daughter. I'm going to my daughter. I'm going to her. Nisha? Have you eaten? My dad made fried pork chops. My dad's pork chops are the best in the world. I hate you. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Come on. Slowly, kid, slowly. You'll choke. Hmm? Is it good? <laughs> Look, Ling Xiao, I've glued the pieces together. Your little sister is now an angel. She and my mom are together. And after many, many years here, we will go where they are. When we get there, we'll see them both again. Who told you that? My dad. My dad knows everything. He's lying. They're dead. Dead means they're gone. Well, if they're gone, where did they go? They're gone forever. I'll never see them again. Why is that? Because everyone dies. And when they do, you just burn their things, tear their photos up, so that you can forget. Your dad did it. Come. to show you my papa's secret. See? This is my mom. And these are also my mom. That. Do you miss her? I miss her, but I have to pretend I don't miss her because dad will get too sad. But when you miss your mom, what do you do? Then I draw her. I like to draw my mom's face. When I'm alone, I also miss my mama, but my dad can't know. But when you're alone, you can also miss your sister. Just don't let your mom and dad know. Sweet and sour spare ribs, let's go! <laughs> 
<coughs> hey, Chen Teng! Can I eat my dinner without all that racket? Yeah? Who's making a racket now? Oh, hold still, just hold still. Oh, looks like a worm. Look, it's crawling out of your nose. <laughs> my goodness. <laughs> hey, don't eat too fast. Slow down. <laughs> Hello? Is this Li Hai Chao? It's me, Ho Mei. Ho Mei? I... All right, calm down. Tell me. Can I borrow some money from you? Huh? My mom is sick. I have to go home. I'm so sorry. Also, I was hoping that you could take uh, care of Su Chu even for a little while. Uh, sure. Don't worry about it. Uh, I'll pick him up, okay? Uh... Jen Jen, Ling Xiao, uh, I have something to attend to. It's urgent. You two take your time, okay? Once you're done eating, you can go together and play at Mrs. Chen's, huh? Wait for me there. You hear me? Mm. Oh, when you leave, lock the door. Take care of Jen Jen, okay? Right. I have to go now. Come, Zucho, come inside. This is going to be your room, huh? You can stay here. I can fix you up a bed somewhere here. <laughs> How is it? <sighs> Let me show you around the house, huh? This is the kitchen. That's where I'm gonna make you good food, huh? And that's a toilet. Here's the living room. Ah, uh, oh, see all those toys? You can play with them, huh? Ah. Uh, that over there is Lee Jen Jen's bedroom. Uh, do you want a little tip? She's a bit grumpy. She gets so mad. But you're much older than her. A big brother. You have to be patient. Mm. Good boy. So when are you going to marry my mom? I'm what? What do you mean? I saw you earlier giving my mom money. It was a big bunch of hundred yuans. And now you're letting me live in your house. Zucho, come here. So what if I gave your mom money? My second aunt told me about it. If a man gives a woman money, it's a betrothal present. They're going to get married. <laughs> Betrothal's a big word. Your mom accepted her betrothal. That means from now on, you're my son. You have to listen to me. You understand? Hey, Zucho, stop it, you're scaring me. I was just kidding, okay? Pa! Uh, huh? Pa! <laughs> right. My son. Pa! <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go clean your room, son. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> my son. <laughs> you can't stay at my house. Jen Jen. My dad is not your dad. Stop calling him that. Hey, don't be mean to Zucho. You hear me? <laughs> what now? What's the matter? Oh. Hey, no. Hey, why are you biting him, Jen Jen? Let him go. Let him go. Let go! What are you, a dog? Enough! No meat for you, Jen Jen! Enough of this, Jen Jen! You're acting like a feral child! Let's head down to a civilized hey. Come on! Listen to Li Hai Chao. Right I heard he's brought home his girlfriend's son. They say the woman had to go home to take care of her sick mother. I don't think he imagined that Jian Jian would get so mad at him. Hear that? She's so upset. <laughs> hey, Li Xiao, aren't you hungry? He's not hungry. Every meal time, he's at Chen Chen's house. Chen Ting, you have to cook for our son every meal time, or he'll go hungry. This is why he's always rushing to the neighbor, because he's hungry. 
You treat this place like a hotel, so what do you even care? Show. Better eat it, eat it, eat it all up. <laughs> you have to memorize your lessons, okay? When did you bring this back? That's a really good photo of us. What happened? Give it to me. Hey, hey, Chen Ting. That's the last photo of us. Let the poor boy keep it, okay? Give it hey. to me. Go, go to school. Give it to me! Give it to Stop me! It. Stop it! Are you crazy? Why did you hit our son? Of course I'm crazy. I should have choked him the walnut! Enough! Will you stop bringing that up? We know it was an accident and you're not to blame. Right. You're not blaming me and I have to thank you for all that, huh? She was your daughter, but you never cared about her. And now here you are judging me from your high horse. I'm the one to blame for it all. I'm Am not right? judging it you. It's all my fault. fault. But can we stop bringing this up? Let's move on with our lives. You can move on. You can leave this house anytime. But I have to stay here like nothing has gone wrong. I have to stay here like nothing has gone wrong. And you? Um, you? Why'd you give her that? Why did you give your sister those walnuts? Hey, will you stop talking about walnuts? You've said enough. It's not like I'm lying. It's his fault. He killed his sister. Will you just stop talking about he it? He killed my daughter. <laughs> Shut up! Ooh. 
So this Chan Ting, she was out playing mahjong with her friends. Ling Xia was home taking care of his sister. The little girl loved walnuts, so Ling Xia would always give her a few. Nothing bad would happen. But on that day, something did happen. A small piece of walnut got stuck on the poor girl's windpipe, but the door was locked from the outside. So Ling Xiao couldn't call for help. The two children were trapped and one of them choking. When Chang Ting came home, the girl had already been dead for a long time. Who told you about this? They used to live in Bailey Staff Housing. An odd of my lives there. I was visiting her the other day when she told me about it. This Chang Ting, she couldn't stand living there. Her neighbors judging her, so they moved here. It was an accident. How could she have known? <sighs> she was just three years old, that little girl. It's such a tragedy. A child looking after a younger child? What kind of mother would think that's all right? <sighs> Don't say that. She's been having a hard time. You neighborhood committee, you can't see straight. <laughs> if you ask me, Hopping should divorce her so they can all live in peace. It's long overdue. If I knew any kind single lady, I'd introduce her to him. <laughs> Remember? When I introduced Hai Chao to that nice woman, he's taken her son in. The boy's calling him dad now. Hey, see this? This is for being a good matchmaker. Oh, it's from Hong Kong. That's good, huh? <laughs> oh, wow, it does look nice, huh? Uh -huh. <laughs> hey, Hai Chao, when are you and Hong Kong getting a marriage certificate? Hey, it's too early for that. Uh, we're still dating. Hey, hey, Hai Chao. You better invite us to the wedding party, okay? Ah, oh, yes, he should. <laughs> Look, he's blushing. <laughs> hey, it's your turn. Oh, it's my turn? There. Hey, Chow. I'm here to get my boy. Shh. He's sleeping. Oh, he's sleeping? Why do you always come home late? Uh, I'm working on a case. I've been very busy. Uh, uh, have you had dinner? No, I haven't. I have food in the kitchen. Come in. <laughs> oh, okay, I'll come Just in. Just go on in. Since our arrival, we've been causing you trouble. Thank you. Well, what trouble? It's not trouble. What's one more plate? Mm, this is good. <laughs> uh, have you heard about my family problems? Well, the neighbors are being mean. Hmm? Uh, there. They're bored, so they talk, huh? It entertains them. <laughs> <laughs> I know what they're doing. I'm a police officer. Oh. These neighborhood gossips, the worst they can do is talk about you and your problems. In one ear, out the other, then on to the next story. Hmm. That I understand. You know who I don't understand? Chen Ting. I don't know what's wrong with her. Every day the situation's just getting worse. Every day she has to shout about something. And I really don't know what to do anymore. And I swear I've been doing my best to comfort her. heard about my story yeah I heard about your story it was just a year ago it must be hard <sighs> when uh, 
When Hui Yin died, I was very upset. And the neighbors, they came to comfort me. But you know what? The words they used to comfort me were like knives. Step, 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 when you're most vulnerable. I felt guilty. Why did I let her decide? Why wasn't I able to convince her? How could I have believed that being positive can cure her? Why didn't I listen to what the doctors told us? So I get you. Regret is so difficult to live with. If you ask me, Chen Ting is finding it very difficult to forgive herself. So she acts up. She was pregnant with Yun Yun. It took three months for us to know. She wanted to keep the baby, and for that she lost her job. And I... I got fined by our unit. They took away my merits. <sighs> Goodbye promotion. I almost lost my job. But the truth is, I don't regret that experience. a very happy child. He loves to talk to people. But now look. He barely utters a word. What has that kid done to deserve this? Look at your Jan Jan. Such a nice kid, huh? Huh? <laughs> she really is. Oh, I know. Oh, Jan Jan, my gosh. She's something else. She's unique. She's unlike me, and unlike her mom. <laughs> I don't know where she gets her personality from. <laughs> that girl is so optimistic for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> Just be thankful. All right, then. To optimism. <laughs> <laughs> and to our departed. Cheers. To our departed. Shao always comes down here to eat. Mm, these are the best pickles in the whole city. Mm, so good. <laughs> eat as often as you like. Treat this as your home. Mm, I don't want to be a burden. Are you kidding me? What burden? I'm mm. not going to be a burden. Just think about it. The kids will have each other. Am I right? Well, you don't have to convince me anymore. <laughs> come as you like. <laughs> here you go. Mm. <laughs> mm. And it gets better. Say... You want to have noodles? Tell me, mm, and I'll make I it. I want pork chops tomorrow, okay? <laughs> <laughs> hey, by the way, this one neighbor of ours.
Clinton. Breakfast time. It's your first day of school. Don't be late. Don't take long. You better step it up. You'll be late. Hi, Pa. Here's the breadsticks and rice cakes. Okay. Tell Ling Xiao it's breakfast time. Okay. <laughs> Li Jin Jin, that you in there? You wanna smell my poop? Hurry up, I need to pee. Don't be a pest, I'm concentrating. Is it show? How many times? Don't do your business while I'm brushing my teeth. Sorry, sorry, it won't happen again. Now get out. Huh? I'm taking this with me. Hey, you can't do that! <laughs> Luckily, I have a plan B. I'm screwed. Jen Jen, come on. Come Breakfast. Hey, listen up. Our Jen Jen is in grade 10. You're in grade 12. You're in the same school. Don't let her get in trouble. I don't want to be a fixture at the principal's office. Remember, you're her elder brothers. Hmm? Hmm. Don't worry, Dad. I'll look after her. Don't worry, Dad. I'll look after them. Hmm. Jen, Jen, shout with your rice cake.
在这。